Next we'll take a look at the Snapshot tool. The Snapshot tool here has three options in a little flyout menu. Snapshot the whole page, Snapshot a rectangular selection, or Snapshot a freehand selection. When you do this you're going to capture the image. So I'll do the full screen first. That's the easiest. When I click capture full screen it's going to bring up the next menu which is do I want to save it as a snapshot, open it as a PDF, print it, or copy it to my clipboard. I'll save it as a snapshot. And there you can see now my sidebar there's the image that I just created using the snapshot tool. If I double click on it it will open it up there it is in my Windows Photo Viewer. You can also click on Snapshot and choose Rectangular Selection. If you do this, then you just drag a box around the area you want to capture. When you release the mouse, it will give you the option to save it as a snapshot, open it as a PDF printer, or copy to clipboard. And finally, there's the Snapshot Capture Freehand Selection. When I click that, you can drag a box around or a freehand shape around any part of the screen and then I'm going to copy this into my clipboard and use the paste tool. Now you can see I've got a pasted copy of that image. So in closing, the snapshot cap shot allows you to capture the page, or a rectangular selection or a freehand selection and it allows you to either save it as a snapshot, a PDF, print it directly to your printer, or copy it to your clipboard.